It is so bloody warm. Today I'm going to do some location scouting for a little winter camping session. Originally my plan was to build an igloo or a snow cave. However, it's so warm right now. It's five degrees up on the mountain and a snow cave really only makes sense when it's below zero because the inside usually stays around zero degrees. But yeah, maybe I can uh, come up with a little bit of an open concept. But first I need to find a suitable spot, see what we can find. Yeah, basically I'm looking for a place that's not too steep, that's west facing because I want to watch the sunset and yeah, ideally just outside the resort so I can take a lift to get there because I'm lazy. So I'm gonna tour up a little bit, probably to those trees. Not a lot of snow for 2,000 meters. It's also not great for building a snow cave. I'm gonna put skins on. Check this area out. Oh, maybe here. So yeah, I think I found a spot that's suitable. There was a gully over there with two meters of snow in it, but it's kind of in a hole, so you couldn't really see the nice surroundings. So here it's about a meter deep, perfect for the sunset. So let's just put camp up here. Oh, yeah, it's okay. I'll make the outline of my bed like here. Yeah, should do. I'm pretty happy how my bedroom turned out. I think I'll be putting the bar right next to it. It's more of a snow studio than a snow apartment. At least I don't have to go far from the bar to the bedroom, which is nice. I think it's coming along quite nicely. I mean, I could have done it all in the day and slept here tonight, but I didn't really know. But it's fine because now it can actually freeze a little bit overnight and make it all a bit stronger. And tomorrow we can do the fine tuning and enjoy some nice food and drink. And we're back. This is my little survival setup for tonight. Basically glamping, let's be honest here. Over here is my uh, queen size bed. Also doubles as a drone landing and starting platform. Right in front of me, the bar area. Today we'll be having a four course menu. Starting it off with some tomato mozzarella. Fitting for the occasion, I got the frozen plates. Then there's actually two benches in case more people are coming. And then of course, most importantly, we have the actual snow bar cooling area, which is also kind of optimistic. Back over there, we have the gear area and the telephoto setup. And here the main, the main bench. Well, that's about it. Should be a nice sunset. Here we got the pork, nice little cabbage. Right, so that's my humble dinner. Pork roast with dumplings and cabbage. And vice beer, of course, because gotta pair those things up. Cheers, let's see if we survive the night. Mm. 
I'm not just saying this, this is really fucking good. Check out my party setup. So I got these $10 fairy LEDs from Amazon, which are covering the front of the snow cave now. Obviously we got some candles in the back. Now they're sinking into the snow, so actually makes the light even nicer, which is cool. So yeah, I think I'm ready for course number three now, which is cheese. So we have a little bit of chèvre. <laughs> we got a little bit of roquefort. <laughs> we got some chôme. <laughs> And we got some tea basque. Okay, so. And the view ain't too shabby either. For dessert, we have some cappuccino cheesecake, which I totally made myself at home. That's very good. And I already made some tea. Right, about to hit the hay here. See you in the morning. Good morning. That wasn't so bad. It actually got so warm at some point that I took off. When I took off this jacket, well, let's put it back on. Right, sun should be up any second now. It's really hazy today, which I think is also the reason why I didn't see that many stars last night. Because even with the moon, so, well, it hasn't rained or snowed in a while, so I guess a lot of dust in the atmosphere. mint in the morning. Oh, okay. Yeah. Obviously, had to have one kitchen mishap. A topfen muffin. Don't worry, I'll still have sausages. Good. I kind of feel like I'm eating better food when I'm camping than when I'm at home. Weird. There we have it, another vlog, another night in the mountains. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to build a snow cave, so if winter makes a comeback, I'm definitely gonna try to do that. But yeah, apart from that, it's pretty nice up here. In the next vlog, we'll be going to Osterol and skiing insane amount of pow. So if you wanna see that, hit that subscribe -y thingy. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs>